Good morning, Internet. So, here I am today, uh, just introducing the notion of, uh, of making public my retranslations from uh, Masaki Hatsumi's Unarmed Fighting Techniques of the Samurai. Um, I was just, years ago when it first came out in 2008, I was, well, ecstatic and vibrant, and frankly, my book, my copy of that's falling apart. Um, but, uh, yeah, awesome book. It covers uh, the mostly um, unarmed fighting techniques of six out of nine of the uh, the Ryuha of the Bujinkan. <clears throat> um, I have seen various uh, different variations of each of the dencho for these traditions, and I do find that there are variations between them depending on who actually wrote the the uh, or took the notes, um, whether it's from Hatsumi whether it's from Takamatsu, whether it's from um, Ishizuka, um, so on and so forth. <clears throat> and uh, so in any case, <laughs> that rambling aside, I'm here today to introduce the lovely, 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 check my lyrics. Check my lyrics. There we go. Alrighty. So the first one I did, obviously, was uh, Gyoku Ryu Koshijutsu. This particular one uh, was made up of three different chapters in this. We had bookmarks. We had the initial chapter, the Kihon Hapo. So that's, of course, the fundamental techniques. Boom, with something like that. I took a lot of footnotes. These are footnotes for that chapter, or for that section. Boom, boom, boom. Kihon Hapo, etc., etc., um, and then get into the techniques. Look something like that. Uh, the second chapter was on the Sanshin Kata. Um, so yeah, Chi Sui Ka Fuku, that sort of thing. Interestingly, there are uh, some references to what the Gogyo or the Five Elements um, express. Mm -hmm. And, uh, yeah, because uh, Sam actually lectured about this at some point, how it infers um, a sort of conditioning of the body, not just, uh, excuse the sun, light in my face here, not just, you know, five elements, uh, five, you know, elements of nature that are placeholders as a counting system, but uh, something about conditioning the body, that's a whole other tangent. So, Boom, 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 boom. Footnotes on just the first section of the Sanshin Gata. Um, then it continued into the Taihen Ukemi Gata and uh, Mutodori Gata. So that's kind of really um, an interesting way how it broke down the, uh, uh, the different rolling methods, the breakfalls, um, Ukemi, and the Bujikan sense. Um, yeah, Uru Sui. Dun, dun, dun. Yeah, not really much to say there. Uh, the Taijutsu Mutodori Gata, so the three techniques of uh, Hiru, Hiru no Kamae, Uchimaji no Kamae, and Jumonji um, in regards to facing a sword well unarmed. And then we jump right into the Joryaku no Maki, so the first section of um, Fighting Kata of Gyokuryu. Again, more footnotes. Um, there's a couple really interesting things here. <clears throat> the most of which is this wonderful little poem here doesn't show up in the English section in the Unarmed Fighting Techniques of the Samurai. It's literally omitted. It's completely missing from it. It also was, uh, when I first tackled it, it took me, or it was, um, it was in the earliest part of my um, independently translating. <clears throat> these sorts of things, and it actually took me about five days to try and translate it in some kind of comprehensible way. Uh, I should probably reapproach it now, as that was back in 2008 or 9 that I had done that. Um, in any case, yeah, goes into that. I uh, take um, so facing the opponent, that's actually really interesting there. Uh, Koku, here, Koku, this little thing here, I think is actually missing in the book. 
as well. I happen to have here because I'm working on the Kuki Shinden chapter today. Da, 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 um, Gereku, chureku, joryaku. Yeah, it's completely missing from there. Boom. Uh, 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 it goes right into the technique. So it doesn't have uh, it doesn't have that description. Why? Maybe it was too hard for three professional translators to translate. I don't know. But uh, so that's in there. Something about the mentality around uh, the technique uh, it goes into the kata. As you'll see here, I have the Japanese in there, and I translate it as literally as I can. The reason for that is that as my uh, this was originally just notes from my own reference and uh, and I knew as uh, my technique improved as my Japanese improved as my understanding of the technique and the tradition as a whole improved um, my understanding of these descriptions would change and so I've got the original Japanese here as is shown in the book and uh, and then I've got my translation as literal as I can make it so that was kind of important in my approach. Danchu, Danchi, the whole nine yards, right? And now we've got Churiaku and uh, Geriaku. So those are kind of a part of the whole thing. Um, these initial sections I find to each of the, the chapters was probably the most interesting stuff where it goes on about uh, some of the strategy, but it ends up being cryptic, which is super cool gives you something to think about, and I really, I'm a thinker. I like to sit there and think. Geri uh, and then yeah, Shuru, etc, etc, etc. As you can see, there's a lot of footnotes all the time, usually translation notes. Um, this is some of my earliest work, so the references I make now are much further along than they were before. In fact, I'll probably be updating this. <clears throat> and then, we're excited. And this is Again, back, <laughs> geez, these were citations from like between 2008 and 2012-ish, maybe 13. I haven't updated it in some time. Oh, actually, that's a blatant line. I added something recently. Indeed, I did, like I was mentioning before. The Gogyo no Gokeijo, which is where Kasem was describing, um, uh, describing the nature of the Gokyo Gata. So in any case, Gyokuryo um, Koshijutsu. The link will be in the description. Um, if you guys like, I'm I'm putting all this online for free. If you guys think it's worth value or anything, I would greatly appreciate um, financial donations. Um, I do have a profile set up on Patreon, which. Uh, is right now my favorite platform for receiving any sorts of uh, financial support, incentive, etc. So, uh, hope you guys appreciate this.